So what we've got here is a typical neighborhood here in Atlanta, built in the middle of a forest that's probably several thousand years old. So we're moving into fall here in Atlanta. The leaves are falling off the trees. The insect activity dies down quite a bit, but you start heating your house. And when you heat your house, the siding on your house and the foundation around the house is a little warmer than the environment. So what happens is, is they start moving around this time of year looking for places to lay their eggs. And your siding is a prime example of a place that they would go. They'd climb up to the foundation and if we, if we look in there along the siding, they lay their eggs up in the wall where it's a little bit warmer. Now the, the mother spider may die if it gets cold enough, but her eggs will be up in the wall. And when that hatches, there's a high likelihood that the baby spiders will actually move or shotgun into the house versus come outside. That's one of the primary ways that the spiders actually will get inside the home. What you'll start seeing in the spring is little baby spiders setting up camp in the corners of your rooms, upstairs and in the basement. 